Hey everyone, this is Jonathan, the founder of the Hope Movement. Just wanted to give you a quick report for the month of August 2015 and just say thank you for giving uh, your, of your time and uh, of your finances to help us. Your words of encouragement, your financial support, and your prayers have been such a blessing to us and just really give us the strength to carry on. Wonderful things have taken place um, through the Hope Movement and through various partnerships, and um, one of which is because of that donation that we've been receiving of Mana Pack um, that we're able to provide um, meals six days a week, five days a week at our center in Esquintla, Guatemala, which is over 1,200 meals a month, and then also additional meals um, that we're providing to hundreds of children um, at our other projects that we have. Um, All together, we have uh, uh, six feeding centers, and we're going to be expanding another one very soon. Um, And so I just wanted to just say that This is a wonderful blessing. These are children that a lot of times don't have a meal or they're eating things that are not healthy and so they're malnourished. And so this is really um, changing their lives. And at the same time helps us to provide them with education, with uh, counseling and um, the message of Jesus Christ. So this is just a, a beautiful tool that we're using. A lot of our centers we're now establishing in churches. So that way it really makes the church pushes the church to become the church and be the hands of God and to begin supporting and helping their community. So it gets them out of their comfort zone as well as it's more economical um, ministry wise. And you're able to not only um, help the people in need, but also help the church to be the hands of God and also build their church as well, because people begin to start coming to Jesus and start coming to their church. So it's a wonderful um, partnership. And so these are wonderful things that have taken place. Um, thanks to a wonderful donation uh, from Sean Johnson as well from Recycled Lives as well as from um, Casada Solidaria, um, we were able to get um, a bunch of shoes that were donated and in the month of August we were able to distribute those shoes and we'll continue to do so as well. These are, if you would have saw the shoes that the children had, a lot of them had holes in them um, or they didn't have shoes at all. So this was a huge blessing and really thankful for them for all they've did, that they've done for us as well. And um, and we look forward to seeing how God's going to bless that relationship and friendship in the future as well, So we, and we're praying for them. Um, we've also sent funds, uh, thanks to a, a kind donation to Kenya, Africa, Pastor Frederick, and so we were able to provide some more meals um, for the orphans there in Kenya, and uh, we hope that we're able to really build on this. Uh, we're seeing that God is really leading us uh, to other areas, um, such as uh, Kenya, Uganda, um, Haiti, and uh, and just uh, in other areas as well, as, such as Bangladesh. Um, so there's just wonderful things taking place. And I just encourage you to please be a part of this. Really get inspired to, to give. I mean, the thing is, if you just give $5 a month, that makes a huge difference. And if, if people unite and come together and really help us uh, to provide those funds, um, how no matter how little it is or how big it is, it makes a difference. And so I just really encourage you to please help us. Uh, we really need to raise more funds for the remainder of this year. Next year is going to be a big year. We're going to be expanding a lot of programs, and we really need your help. Um, keep us in prayer. Um, in o- October, we're going to be establishing a Haven of Hope community garden in two locations. Um, near North Avenue in Baltimore City. So this is in a, a rough neighborhood, but we're down there. We're going to be transforming this into a haven of hope. So I ask you to please pray for us as we go down there, not only to establish a community garden, which will generate uh, food for the community and for food, food banks, but also will incorporate the community, young people, provide mentorship and evangelism throughout the community. And we encourage all the churches in the area to come out and to be a part of this. This is going to be a monthly thing, and we need your volunteering time and your prayers and your and your talents to help us with this. So there's wonderful things taking place, and I encourage you to, to stay involved, and, and uh, I just encourage you to, um, to give and to pray with us and join us in our monthly prayer meetings and just um, visit our website at hopemovement.com to learn more. And um, I'll be up in Newcastle, Pennsylvania, um, on September 13th, and we'll be speaking at Pastor Craig's church. So if you're in the area, come on up. And we love you guys, and thank you for all you've done. And I look forward to, to uh, seeing what God's going to do in this month and the coming months. Amen.